Every country on Earth is run by some sort of government, but they are not all the same. Governments are distinguished by who holds the power, how that power is given or attained, and how decisions are made. Autocracy is a form of government where one person has absolute power. Monarchy, or the rule of kings or queens, is one of the most common forms of autocracy in history. Monarchs usually inherit power at birth, whether they're up to the job or not. Some monarchies, such as the one that exists today in Saudi Arabia, have total control. This means that they make all the decisions about how the country is run. The United Kingdom has a constitutional monarchy and is no longer considered an autocracy because the role of the king or queen is generally ceremonial. Dictatorship is the second type of autocracy. In a dictatorship, one person has absolute power over all branches of government. Dictators are not monarchs. They often gain power through deception, corruption, and force, and can rule with an iron fist. They still exist today, for example, in North Korea. In an oligarchy, like modern China, a small group of powerful people control the government. A theocracy is also a type of government run by a small group of people, but in this case, they govern based on their religious beliefs. Iran is an example of a theocracy. So where did democracy start? We have to go back over 2,500 years ago to the ancient city-state of Athens to find the first form of democratic government called a direct democracy. Male citizens were expected to take part in government. But today, most democracies around the world, from the United States Constitutional Federal Republic to Italy's parliamentary system, are representative democracies, where people vote for elected officials to govern on their behalf. What are the pros and cons of different forms of government? 